everyone, welcome back from my next Dollar Tree haul video. Okay, the first thing that I got, oh my goodness, my Dollar Tree, I have been seeing Bolero stuff everywhere on YouTube and my Dollar Tree has not had any. So I was so excited when I went today and I found so much stuff. Okay, so the first thing that I got is hand wash. It's Argon and Shea Butter. Okay, the next thing that I got is facial wipes. I got the bath soap. And I got the body cream. All of this is in the Argon and Shea Butter, and I looked for other scents, but I couldn't find the whole set. So, for the other scents that I got, I have Lavender and Chamomile Soap. I have the Lavender and Sea Salt Fizzy Bath Balm. If you guys, these smell amazing. The other bath bomb I found was the almond milk and honey. Hopefully my daughter doesn't steal these from me because we may be fighting. This has to be my favorite. It's the lemon verbena and mint body cream. I love the smell of lemon. I really hope that they get some more of this in in the soap and the fizzy um, bath bombs. Love, love, love the lemon. So, I was so excited to find that. The next thing that I found was, in my previous video, I hauled these little owls. Um, one was the lip balm and the other, or lip gloss, and the other was the lotion. I couldn't find any more of the lotion, but I did find another lip gloss. And it's yellow, kind of yellowish orange. And it's peach. 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 Okay. That's, that's all you got to say about that is peach. Had to pick that up. Would have gotten more if they had them, but they didn't. The next thing that I got is some retinol makeup cleansing wipes. I picked these up. These work amazing. They're really, really sensitive. Um, I have sensitive skin, so I can't put a lot of things on my face, but these, they don't seem to break me out or anything, so... They're really nice. The next couple of things that I got is the designer, well, I guess the knockoff designer perfumes. I don't typically buy these. I normally see them around Christmas time, but these, I don't know, they called to me today, so I thought I'd give them a shot. One is Lolita, and it is the ver our version of Paris Hilton. So there's that one. And then the next one is Midnight Pearls, and it is our version of White Diamonds. I smelled them in the store, and they smelled okay. Um, smelled pretty nice. So we will see just, you know, how those work. I picked my husband up some because all he ever uses is X. So we wanted to try something different, so we got him Striker, our version of Ed Hardy. And Jordash Men, our version of Nautica. And we were smelling these, but you know when you start smelling too many things. So hopefully that will be really cool. And they're big bottles. It is two and a half fluid ounces, 75 milliliters. So, I mean, they look pretty nice. That's what the bottle of the Jordash looks like. And it, re it really does. It smells really nice. Let's go ahead and pull out all of them. See what the bottles look like. They all kind of look similar. This is the Striker. That is the Ed Hardy. Um, our, their version of Ed Hardy. Midnight Pearls. This is the our version of White Diamonds. And that's what this one looks like. And these are all two and a half ounces, 75 milliliters. And then the last one, Lolita. Oh, that one's a little different. And 
there's that one. So I will let you guys know how I like those once I've tried them out for a little while. Okay, let's talk seriously for a few minutes. Candles at the Dollar Tree. They are hit or miss. Sometimes they smell real good and they last forever. Sometimes, not so much. So, I'm going to give these a shot. I love to burn candles in my kitchen because I'm always chopping up garlic and onions and peppers. So, it gets a little stinky. Ain't going to lie. Everybody cooks. So, I got a, cu a couple. Just a couple. If, like, four or five is a couple. But, um, <laughs> anyhow, this one is a mason jar. And it is tropical passion fruit scented. And it smells, smells almost like candy in a way, but I love the jar and how it has these beveled edges. So for a dollar, I can always reuse these jars. So the next one I got is apricot and basil. Again, it's another one of these little mason jars and this is really, really good glass. You can really smell the apricot, but it's very, very faint. It's not a strong, overpowering scent, which will be good in the kitchen because, I mean, you don't want to smell garlic, onions, and apricots together. I mean, maybe you do. Not me personally. The next couple of um, candles that I got was cucumber melon and mahogany whitewood, and they come in these cute little jars. The cucumber melon, it's, I can't stop. Y'all, it smells really, really good. So that one's really nice. I really hope that one goes really well. This one, I probably won't put in my, the mahogany whitewood, I probably won't put this in my kitchen. This will probably go in my living room or maybe my bedroom. It has more of a woodsy note to it, which I prefer most of the time so this is probably going to go in my living room but i'll let you guys know once i burn them which ones i really like and leave a comment below and let me know what's your favorite scented candle that you found at the dollar tree i may try to go see if i can find it the next one i got is the bath time retreat and i got a couple of these because these jars are just they remind me of those um, apothecary jars, and it smells really nice, kind of florally, which normally I don't go for, but my daughter really enjoys the floral scent, but it's got the little knob on the top, and I you can always reuse these jars, and if anybody doesn't know how to get the candles out of these jars once they've burned down, you can stick it in your freezer for about an hour. And then just go in and it pops right out. And then just wash your jar and you have an empty jar that you can do whatever you want with. So I did pick up a couple of these. Moving along. In my last haul, I got the Sun and Moon Stone Plate that I really liked. And I found another design at a different Dollar Tree that I really, really enjoyed. And it has the silver and the gold. And so I picked one of these up just to match the other one. And if you want to see what the other one looked like, go back to my previous Dollar Tree video and you'll be able to see this one. Or the first one that I got that kind of matches this one. The net, oh guys, these I found are so cute. I only found these two, so I don't know if there's more or not, like different designs. But I got this, and it says, Love Conquers All. I thought, even if it's not Valentine's Day, this would be really cute to decorate with. And then I got a red one that says, Love Every Moment. This one is my favorite. And I absolutely fell in love with these. But I didn't see any other designs. But I really was hoping for a third one. Because I like to do things in three. I don't know. I'm weird. 
So the next couple of things that I got are these really cute little houses. They have, well, if I stand it up, they have these little stands attached to the back of it and a little clip to where you can clip little notes. And it says, family always and forever. And there's that one. And then this one says, home is, you, it, home is where you make it. If I could talk. And I think these are really cute. So there's that one. There's that one. So I picked up two of these. The next item that I got was just a happy birthday to you bag. There's the front. And then there is this side. And then that's the inside. And they had, my hair is getting everywhere. They had two more uh, different, two more designs that fit into this, I guess, genre or category or set, whatever you want to call it. Uh, but I liked this one the best. I loved these colors. And even if I don't need to give a birthday present or anything, I use these for my planner. Sometimes I'll cut them up and use just like different aspects like the flowers or whatever. And sometimes you can make little dividers or covers, all kinds of things with these gift bags. You can make wall art. It's just amazing the things that you can do with the gift bags that you find at Dollar Tree. So my last couple of items are all stickers. So the first one that I got is it has, it comes with 15, and it has a little camera here, and then it has the unicorn, and it says, be yourself with an arrow, be happy, you're awesome, girl talk, hello love, girls night, make today beautiful, gorgeous, and love. So there's that one. And I will insert some pictures of these just in case you guys can't get a good look at these. Um, this one also comes with 15. These are all in the same set. And it says, You're sublime. Donut worry. Be happy. Cute as a cupcake. That's me. <laughs> just kidding. Let's chill. Sweet. Stick with me. This is my jam. Very good. One in a melon. And it's got little lemons and limes. And then the one in a melon is a melon. Your Sublime has a little lime. They're just cute little stickers. You guys are going to see these in my planners. I can guarantee it. Uh, save the drama for your mama. You are great. Be happy. Oh, snap. And then another little unicorn and puppy dog. So there's that one. And then my favorite, Ice Cream Sunday. This is my favorite one. And all these do come with a 15 count sparkle stickers. So they do sparkle. I know that doesn't come across very well. But that one's my favorite. The little Ice Cream Sunday. And then you got another little Ice Cream Sunday up here. Cherries. A little strawberry. And that one says delicious. Sweetie Pie. So I thought those were really, really cute. So my last item that I picked up were these novelty stickers because adulting is hard. And they say, I can't adult today. Adulthood, let's not. I need a nap. I shaved my legs today. Cleverly disguised as a responsible adult. Shh, don't tell nobody. I woke up before noon. Nope, not today. And I put pants on today. I just thought these were super cute. And would be awesome for my planner or whatever. Because I thought they'd be adorable. So that is all of the items that I got at the Dollar Tree. 
So, thanks for watching. Make sure if you liked this video, you hit the like button and subscribe down below. Also, check out my previous videos, and I do post videos every Tuesday and Friday, so hit the little bell icon. That way you guys get notifications and you don't ever miss one. Have a great day. Bye!